to mine. An icon to fans in his native South Korea debut in 2008. Fresh from a win over Amir Sadala. A unanimous decision. So I really want to win tonight by finishing my opponent. Manny Gamburian, which won him the Ultimate Fighter Season 5 crowd. Welterweights have to watch out for the talented kid from... I'm going to beat him and put together a winning streak of my own. The stun gun. He has yet to be defeated. He is aggressive. He is Paro Parisian, but unfortunately Caro tested positive for some Ostacaro. So, and it was a controversial fight with Matt Brown, it was a very good judo, great grappling, able to control guys like Amir Sadat, completely impose his game on Amir, control the top position. Nate Diaz to the ground. Nate Diaz has an outstanding guard. It's uh, one at one, and uh, he has really fantastic throws that he utilizes in the octagon. Korean, Dong Yong Kim. Pound, six foot one, got a nice long reach. Fighter winner, the kid from Stockton, Nate Diaz. And five lightweight winner. He was on fighter in season five, Nate Diaz. And he's looked much better at 170. The Marcus Davis fight he looked out. Tassie jiu jitsu skills, especially off of his back. Long arm to cure them. And uh, just one of the most exciting young fighters in the game. End of his punches that do a ton of damage. And we saw it especially. But when they have to, they put a lot of power behind them. But just the constant barrage is that long reach. I mean, Marcus Davis, we saw in the last fight with Marcus earlier tonight. It's about Joe disrupt your opponent's rhythm, and that's what he's going to look to do tonight. Every Nate Diaz stare down yeah, is a Yeah, that's test. a good point. He does have a good point. Our tail of the team, identical. With the official introductions. Vision, introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is all weighing in at 171 pounds. Fighting out of Busan, South Korea. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red, at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Stockton, California, he is. And when the action begins, our referee in charge. UFC one. Both guys in the southpaw position. Did pre-fight that he's not really overly impressed with the stance, and it seems that, to me that he wants to stay on the outside and try to utilize. It. <laughs> Trying to lock it up, take down, but look out—he goes right into a Kimura. Into it though, lost it, and Kim on top. And I don't think he's fought a guy in the octagon with the kind of guard that Nate Dishon now trying to tie up an arm for many, many years. Note the, the right arm. Trying a big punch by Dong Young Kim. Moves into half guard. He's going to squirm around a lot, try to get back into a full guard position. Yep, got side control. Nope, just Kim on top, though. Look at this. Between him again, back to full guard again. Kim trying to posture up. Watch out for Nate Diaz's left overhook. Nate tries to... Fighter coming off a fight of the night performance in Boston. Recognizes it. Couple of strikes left. Nate's... Kim with that constant pressure here in round one. Yeah, he's keeping Nate on his back. And he, uh, he's, he's forcing Kim displayed here in the round. Again, passing very, very briefly, sort of. Now he's belt. got a hook. And Nate's gonna go die for a leg again. Little he's gonna go for forth. a heel hook. This fight. Uh, you did great. You got yeah, it, yeah. Yeah. yeah, you got the first round. You got the first round. Second time, second time. And press him. That's why he's hitting you. Look at this. Boom! Big punch by Kim. From his back, but really only able to hold Kim off. Really not right, able to get round. much. Quick inside leg kick from Dong Yong Kim. And again, Kim is doing a good job of controlling the distance, Mike. Using for the shot to the body. Was a fighter inside the octagon. 
has won his last two. This is his. Nate gets out of it. He is trying to tackle the triangle. Great posture by Kim, though. As soon as he Nate again, trying to co control him with the, the legs, trying to secure him just rightly across the back of the neck. Twisted position this is. Kim's trying to pass, but every, he's got to be careful of that right leg. Every time that right leg goes into that position, he's got to be locked up for a triangle. Now he's okay. Now he's in double butterfly guard. Oh, very quickly. Nate has a really crafty guard. And he gets to get power behind that when you're doing that. Closes the guard, does Diaz. And again, that right leg of, of Nate Diaz keeps going in this round. Kim again trying. Dong Young Kim. Success in the second round and, and two rounds in a row, he's been able to be controlled and taken down. Again, Nate, every time Nate throws that leg over the back of the neck, Nate rolling over, Kim's got his back now. But Kim controlling his legs here. Yeah, he's, he's an excellent grappler, Mike, yeah. and he's just completely shut down the... Nate Diaz turned around and got his back. 15 seconds on the clock, Joe. Oh, wow. It's for Kim. Jeff, get down low, bro. He tries to do little drastic shots, all right? Yeah, move around. He's trying to win rounds on that. He's getting... Richard Perez. I think so, I think so. You can do it. One more. Nate Diaz is round. They don't seem very happy with the way things are going. Vinny. Yeah, Nate has got it. Oh, nice right hook, too. Proof stand up, Mike. Nate Diaz got him back, though. He'll punish him here if he can. Push Diaz off. Well, Nate had a golden opportunity there. Joke here, Mike. He's pulling him down. Got some knee. Eve Levine. Did he have a knee down? That's what he said. Yes. Yeah. Well, let's take a look at that in the replay so we can. Uh... Yep, he's got a hand down. Any knee from. Man, that's tight. That's close. I feel all right. Let me see it one more time, please. Here we go. I believe that his hand was up. On the doctor. Great look. Uh, yeah, man, that's uh, that's doctor close. Or you play. Sir. Diamond, fight! Bentham. 315. Judoka, fourth degree judo black belt. Yeah, we really saw that in the. Uh, and he's just about in a side control here. Nope, Nate here. Nate back up to his feet. Turn the corner and take his back. He pulled him on top of him. He's got Nate Diaz's right arm trapped. But Nate gets out of it right away. Dong Young Kim very aware. Notice how he kept all his weight on that leg. Yep. Great. Yeah, he looked to Eve Levine like Eve Levine's gonna kind of rescue him, but that's, you know, right back up to his feet. That's how strong his grappling is. Fight, Mike. Absolutely. He's trying to stop him. Oh, good body, body shot. Nate's gonna do something. He's gotta do it now. He's definitely pushing the pace. Yeah, Nate's pouring it on. Final 10 seconds. We will go to the judges' scorecards. On and on in that last round. Take down by Kim. And here's another one. A big part of this fight. And here, Nate Diaz punches towards the end. It's official, and here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judge. The stun gun, Don Young. Congratulations! Excellent, excellent performance. Miss Stun Gun, I want GSP.
Okay, um, what, what, what was the game plan? I don't know what to do, but I just want to do it. Pulled him down and uh, it was a, a grappling match. That's why he became a grappling match. Still able to land some good punches and kicks in this fight as well. Were you happy with your performance? I don't know what to do. Uh, my name is Ninja Stungun this time, but his next fight, he'll be sure.